Hello everyone and welcome to this week's edition of Environment Matters. I'm Mike Huff. It's the largest one-day volunteer cleanup in the country, but this year's Ohio River Sweep will have a different look and feel. Every June, thousands of volunteers gather along the shoreline of the Ohio to remove tons of trash. The event was postponed this year due to the COVID-19 pandemic. It's organized by Orsanco, the Ohio River Valley Water Sanitation Commission. We spoke to Communications Director Lisa Cochran via Zoom. I guess this has been a little bit of a logistical challenge this year with all the changes that, uh, that COVID-19 has, uh, has brought about. Yes, it has been very challenging, but we are extremely grateful that so many of the coordinators of River Sweep want to participate and want to make it happen safely as they can. Our biggest challenge is that the Ohio River Sweep is a regional event. Six states participate in the Ohio River Sweep. And of course, right now, the six different states have slightly different restrictions on social gatherings. So the first thing the coordinators need to pay attention to is their state restrictions. We want the program to honor those state restrictions and those state safety requirements. So that's the first thing that we're paying attention to is what the governors say and what the departments of health are saying. Have you gotten a lot of cancellation or is it a lot of people just working to, to reschedule? We have been very lucky that the vast majority of our coordinators want to make the Ohio River Sweep happen. And so the program suggested delaying all river sweeps until mid-August. And that works for some communities, but not all. And so the program had to be extremely flexible this year. We told the coordinators to select a date that works for their community and honors the safety of their state's restrictions and the safety of their volunteers and coordinators. So some are delaying until August and some are delaying until later and a few have canceled. It's extremely important that the program is very flexible this year. As of our June 30th recording, two West Virginia sites have decided to cancel their cleanups, one in Wood County and one centered at Harris Riverfront Park in Huntington. The others are rescheduled for August 15th, or in the case of a cleanup in Huntington's High Lawn neighborhood, a date in October to be announced later. I think we're really lucky, honestly. You mm -hmm. know, I mean, we're still kind of holding our breath in the sense that we, you know, obviously don't know what will happen even in August, but the vast majority of the coordinators have rescheduled. Last year, about 3,000 people took part in the sweep, collecting 20,000 bags, about 230 tons of trash from 130 locations along the river shoreline. The Ohio River sweep has taken place every year since 1989. An updated list of this year's cleanup sites, dates, times, and coordinator contacts is available at Orsanco's website, orsanco.org. Folks planning to take part in one of the rescheduled cleanups are encouraged to check in with local coordinators. In Huntington, I'm Mike Huff. Thanks for watching.